Welcome back to the Zamajack. Today we got Gunslinger Airship Suicidal. How are you guys doing today? I've been I've been doing something unusual for me. I've been watching uh, movies. I I haven't watched movies in a long, long, long time. Not uh, not for just fun, just for me, but um, I've. Uh, I'm watching Pirates of the Caribbean, actually. Um, not because I, like I'm I'm like obsessed with sailing and I want to watch a sailing movie because it's like it's not really um, a sailing movie so much. Um, but I've been typing a lot of Jack Sparrow quotes on Typeracer lately, just tons of them. And uh, every time I, I I type one, it's always a. Uh, it's always it's always moderately humorous, and I'm like, you know what? Like, let's it's, let's just do it. You know, let, let's just let's just watch it. I ended up um, there was uh, there was somebody on a sailing subreddit who was asking how you anchor like respectfully and responsibly and blah 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 blah, right? So somebody sent a the video of um of Jack Sparrow. When he was like being introduced, and he's riding the the ship into like onto the dock, you know. And I'm like, I right, yeah okay, like I, I get the humor here. It's it's funny. Um, so I've been watching it, and it is it is a funny movie. Um, I binged two of them. I just finished the second one, which is the um, Davy Jones chest or whatever. Just finished that one. Uh, last, or I finished um, the Curse of the Black Pearl today. Started it yesterday, but uh, finished it up today. And then I managed to binge all of the second one today. Somehow I managed to have the time for all of that, so that was pretty impressive for for me. Um, actually, I have to go use the, the washroom real quick. We'll be right, we'll be right back. All right, we're back. What was I talking about? I can't remember. Oh yeah, I'll probably watch um, the third one tomorrow. Um, yeah, it's good. It's a good movie. I um, I'd heard bits and bobs about it, and I've you know typed and heard lots of uh, Jack Sparrow quotes over the years. But um, watching the movies, they're very different to what I had uh, thought they'd be. Um, I was expecting more villainous kind of stuff, you know? Oh my dear lord. I did get like two kills there though, when I was getting surrounded. I did do it. We were doing pretty good. Um, so anyway, I expected more villainous. It's really more anti-hero than um, like the villain perspective, you know? Which is yeah, fine, but not really uh, what I was expecting going into it. It is a very funny franchise. I'm having a lot of fun watching it. It's, uh, yeah, they're fun. They are fun. And then the Jack Sparrow quotes are, are oftentimes great. You know, it's a lot of things that I've, I've heard over the years and references that I'm now kind of like understanding and stuff, you know? And uh, it's fun. It's fun. You know, like, uh, right at the start. So you have heard of me. or But you have heard of me. You know, like that kind of cocky, arrogant stuff. And the acting in it is just amazing. Is it, uh, is, who is it? Brad Pitt? Is that who plays Captain Jack Sparrow? He does a great job in that role. Um, so it's, it's, it's a funny, it's a funny franchise. It's, 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 I like it. But I was I was expecting more villainous. You know, it's it's a you know it's a it's a Disney franchise, so wasn't expecting you know like terrible real depiction of pirates. You know, but it's it's really like they're just kind of going about saving people and the world and stuff. And I'm like, I don't know, the plot doesn't really interest me. But, um, 
the plot like super doesn't interest me to be honest with you. like like all the romance that's happening and like the stories that are developing and stuff I'm like I don't really care it doesn't really matter to me what I the only reason I'm watching this movie is because anytime Jack Sparrow is in a scene I tend to get a good laugh that's that's it that's that's the that's the whole reason why I'm enjoying the movie at all is is just because um, that his his character is 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 quite humorous. But all the story with um, you know the curse and the chest and all of the uh, all of the adventure and all this kind of like I just yeah. It's just uh, it's just a comedy with um with bits of you know I don't know advertisements that are completely pointless baked in between but it's it's an enjoyable movie anyway I'm enjoying it I'm definitely having fun I mean I binged two of them right like I don't watch movies all that often so it's very very my god it's very strange that I'd uh, done it at all so and uh, it's about as accurate to, to, to sailing like for real as I'd expect I think they're actually um getting some stuff right I'm, I'm not like a, a sailor yet but uh, just kind of with my knowledge of it I'm like I don't know it, it feels like they're getting some of it right like like what they actually talk about when it comes to sailing is generally not super wrong and the issue is that there's a lot of like magic and stuff happening as well so like it's not all really and then sometimes they they go you know completely overboard with stuff that's just not really true at all. But you know, and the boats stay like just just shockingly straight. All of the boats are just very stable. I'm like, wow, these are some shockingly stable boats. I'd I'd be expecting a lot more. You know, is it healing or whatever? Expecting a lot more. Uh, crazy how how, uh, how sideways boats can go there's apparently a, a challenge or whatever for for some boats um it's like a, ma a, a mast walk or something where you just like turn the boat on its side while it's out at sail you just like turn it on the side so the mast is like on or like in the water and then you just walk up to the tip of the mast and like walk back down and the boat just like Alright, we're good. It just like flips itself back up and so just writes itself. Marvel of engineering. And uh, they do that. You know, boats are able to do that because your boat's gonna do that. <laughs> you know, like your boat is going to turn over and roll and rock and it's gonna be really, really, really extreme. Um, that's why they're so good at staying upright when they, uh, when they heal like that. Um, so, one thing I've kind of been chuckling at is just how stable everything is on the boat. It's like this terrible storm on the, uh, on the boat, and they're just, like, pretty straight. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know about that. I'm not, I'm not so sure. You know, it's hard to, to get that into the camera, especially back in, like, 2007. Um, but I'm just like, ah, you know, it's a little bit, it's a little bit stable there. Your footing is a little bit, uh, it's a terrible storm and you're just running up the, the, the staircase with, uh, without using any kind of, um, support on the, on the side there. Just, you got these, like, six meter waves, six meter waves out there and you're just, you're just kind of walking around normal. I, I don't know about that so much. I don't, I don't know about that so much. It's a pretty big boat, so it's, it's you know it's gonna be fairly stable. But I mean, yeah, it's even still, you know, I just uh, a lot of displacement for sure. But I'm just kind of looking at it like, yeah, they just didn't really care to to add in the whole like the boat sideways, you know, like that kind of thing. But um, you know, other than some of the, the more egregious stuff like that, it seems pretty normal. Not a, not a place you'd go to learn about sailing stuff, though. It's, as much as it is about pirates, it's not really about sailing. 
honestly, like the whole like pirate and ocean part of it is it could really just be removed, and you'd, you'd end up with pretty much the same story. You know, Davy Jones, rather than being the the sea, he's he's just the air. You know, the the water just kind of. It's not. It's not really adding anything to the to the story. I don't think. It's not really adding anything to the filmmaking. It's not adding anything to, to any of this kind of stuff. Besides a lot of water. Which uh, I guess they they wanted that dramatic effects and stuff. I mean, it's you know. They made a good movie, so I can't uh, can't complain. But I just I feel like in general the water isn't really playing much of a role in uh, in the movies. Cause water, the water don't care. It's gonna, it's gonna mess you up. It don't matter. It, 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 it don't care if you're, you know. But then you know, at the same time, would it be an enjoyable movie for like kids? If the whole movie was just rocking back and forth from like, you know, 20, 30 degrees of uh, of uh, rotation this way and then back over this way and. You know, when you're riding a little bit, uh, not directly into the wind, you're kind of like healing over like, you know, 20 degrees just constantly. And I don't know. I don't know. It wouldn't really be a great movie for for watching, I suppose. And then again, like, the other thing is it is a fairly large boat, so it would be reasonably stable. So, you know, it's just, it's just the, the, I think my main problem with it is like the, the, like, Severity of the uh, of the, the the storms that they're putting them in, because you know the storms are built up for for movie purposes as well, right? And these huge storms, and and all the people on board are just like, yeah, whatever, it's okay, you know, it's fine. Nobody's like losing their balance. Nobody's holding on to like the the railings and stuff. People are walking. You know, down the the stairs and stuff. You know, forward, and I'm like, ah, it's just, it just doesn't really, doesn't really feel like uh, <laughs> totally accurate. But um, yeah, it's enjoyable. I've been having fun with it. I'll watch the third one tomorrow, maybe, and then uh, I don't know. There's five of them. I thought there was two. <laughs> I thought I thought there were two Pirates of the Caribbean movies. So when I, I looked it up and I'm like, I wonder how many like how many how many do I have to download? There was five, and I'm like, what the heck, dude? Like, are you incredible here? Like, what the heck? This is insane. Where did all these movies come from? I had no idea they existed. All I remember is when I was going camping in like, uh, oh I don't know, 2000. Would have been 2007, yeah, because it would have been when the second one came out. All I know is uh, I went camping in 2007, and uh, everybody was making fun of me for not having watched Pirates of the Caribbean. And they were all talking about going to the theater and watching it and stuff, and I'm like, I don't know, I haven't even seen the first one. And then that's like, I thought they stopped making them after that. <laughs> but boy, have I been out of touch. There's five. Like, where, 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 did, where did it all come from? Where did it all go? Where did it all come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Where did it all come from? People disgust me. We'll never know. I mean, we will. Hollywood, you know, they made a bunch of sets and stuff and recorded. I want to know how it was recorded. Because the, the first one was made in, like, 2003. I don't know. And then, like, at the very least, the, the ships and stuff looked fairly good. So I want I want to know how they recorded all of that and got all the 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 like ocean and all that kind of stuff and all the all the stuff. I'd be interested in in seeing how that was done. I always I always like that kind of stuff, you know, like the the filmmaking um, stuff. Whenever you get like the the behind the scenes on on how stuff was recorded, because it's, it's super cool how they like find solutions to all these problems, you know, problems that uh, you don't even know exist, you know. They're like, well, we want to make sure that this uh, this bridge looks broken, but we didn't really have a bridge that was broken, so we just, you know, did it this way. I'm like, I, I what? Like, I would have figured you just go to a broken bridge, but you just you just make your own broken bridge. It's just cheaper than flying everybody else and, and all the camera and stuffing out, I guess. But like, uh, it's always super cool when 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 I see that kind of stuff. Anyway, um, we're gonna end the video here.
It's getting a little bit late. I'm sorry the sailing episodes go on a little bit long and it kind of... But, uh... <laughs> we're gonna end it here. Um, thanks for watching. Watch Pirates of the Caribbean if you haven't. They're good movies. I like them. They're fun. Um, like the video, comment, subscribe. Do all that kind of stuff, dude. And uh, I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.